Well, specifically, um, we have a food pantry um, that does two regular food distributions a month. Um, we also do emergency food um, assistance uh, if someone needs a food. Just um, you know, during the week, they can make an appointment and come in. They don't have to wait for our, our Saturday food distributions. Um, so we, we're helping in that regard. Also, through those programs, we have a mentoring program, uh, a, uh, an educational uh, program for um, just kind of trying to come up alongside people and, and educate them on uh, you know, what they can be doing different within their own home to help make ends meet. Uh, and then, you know, we have counseling programs, master level state license counseling programs that don't charge any fees. Um, so, you know, doesn't, you don't have to be any particular socioeconomic level to be able to, to receive those. So we do see um, folks that are struggling to make ends meet taking advantage of those programs uh, to be able to help them get through things. Because one of the things that, that we find that our counseling programs are helping is when finances aren't there, that brings an added stress to the family. And the family dynamics can sometimes take a really big hit on that. And if we can offer some counseling services for those families to help help them cope with their financial difficulties, we find that it is helpful. Well, the, I guess the, the easiest way to describe the need would be to come into the office on a, a, on a Monday morning and um, just be able to try to uh, hold the phone down. Um, it's it, it just continuously is ringing with people calling um, for different situations that are happening in their home. Um, some of them from losing their home to you know losing their jobs to um, you know their marriage is falling apart to they don't know how to handle their kids right now because they're you know everybody's just so stressed out. We need more space and we're in the process of uh, a vision project which is to uh, convert our, our current office space with two small counseling offices into um, five to six larger offices so that our, our current staff of um, nine therapists, uh, seven at this site, um, are, are able to have an appointment when they want to have an appointment and not have to you know work around everybody else's schedule. I just think it's uh, it's going to allow us to serve more people. Um, right now, we currently have a have a waiting list of uh, probably about half a dozen to a dozen uh, folks that are waiting to be seen for our, our counseling services. And uh, part of that is not because we don't have the staffing; it's because we don't have the the, the room to be able to to see those folks. Um, because we're seeing the the limited number of people we can see right now with the. Um, the rooms that we have available to see them in.